Hey guys, it's Jay from the Kokomo Post. We're here at the filling station for our next episode in our Gridiron Gourmet series where we meet with local chefs and bartenders to help make your game day the best one yet. All right, we're here with Biz Bates from Sun King. And Biz, before we get into what we're gonna to make today, tell us a little bit about Sun King and what you guys do. So I'm Biz Bates. I'm the bar manager and event coordinator at Sun King Kokomo. We're located in the historic train depot down at a 500 North Buckeye. We focus um, on continually creating craft beers that are unique and traditional. We do both craft cocktails as well, which is what we're doing today. So what exactly are we gonna to make today? We're gonna to start off with a non-alcoholic version actually, mm -hmm. and it's a sunlight margarita with a non-alcoholic beer. That sounds fantastic. It sounds so easy. I can make it, right? Correct. Let's go into it and I'll actually show you. Let's get to it. So we're gonna start with your glass. Okay. You're going to dip it in your lime juice, move it around a little bit to get a good coverage on it. And then we're gonna dip it in the salt and you're gonna do the same action so you have a nice salt rim. We're going to take your large shaker and put just a little bit of ice in there for me. We're going to start with our sour mix. So we're gonna do one and a half ounces of sour. And that's this one here? Correct. Perfect. The lime juice, which is three quarters ounce. Fresh lime juice, so it's gonna be really good. We all like fresh. And then on that bottom line there, mm -hmm. you're going to take the simple, which is half water, half sugar, that is just um, boiled together. Okay. And then that way it's well incorporated. Bam, let's make this work. And go ahead and pour that in. Grab both ends and give it a good shake. Go ahead and fill that up. We're gonna go ahead and start straining it into the glass. And this is a good non-alcoholic version for a margarita. You're gonna have a lot of those traditional lime and sour lemon notes. But what makes this a sunlight margarita is the fact that we're gonna take our non-alcoholic sunlight beer and we're gonna to top off the rest of the glass with that. So if you wanna pour that in. Yeah. And we're gonna finish it off with a lime. That's it? Yeah. That's that simple? It. Super simple to make. Guys, I'm not good at stuff like this, but this is really easy to make. Guys, I can't wait to taste this, but before we do biz, let's make a cocktail for everyone else to enjoy as well. Sounds great. All right, Jay, so we've made a mocktail. Now we're gonna do a traditional cocktail for the people who do enjoy alcohol. This is a Cranberry French 75. Ooh, that sounds good. We're gonna add ice to our shaker again. We're going to do the ounce and a half again of the Sun King Gin. And this is an American gin, so it's gonna be a little more floral. Got a leak. Okay. Got a leaky bottle. <laughs> Next, we're gonna add our cranberry juice. So we're gonna do an ounce and a half of cranberry juice. And that's your first bottle right there. Yep, full ounce and a half of that one. Let's go. And then lastly, we're gonna do a half ounce. So on the other side again, you're going to use our cranberry simple syrup. So that is half cranberry juice, half sugar, and then we add mint and a little bit of rosemary to it while it's boiling. Give it a really good shake again. And what this is gonna taste like is you're gonna have those lovely floral notes from the gin, along with some earthy sweet notes from the cranberry. We're going to top it off with some brute prosecco. Lemon. I like to put the lemon directly into it just to add a little more citrus to oh, it. I dig that. And that's our Cranberry French 75. It's not bad. Not bad at all. Biz, that was so simple. I can't wait for our viewers to try this at home. But this part is my favorite part of the day where we get to try these drinks. Cheers. Guys, that was so good. Stay tuned for the next video in our series. And thank you, Biz, for joining us here at the filling station. For more fun content like this, check us out on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok.